Trial by 14, 2100 hours. This test subject has proven to be very... Despite punishment from multiple attempts to run away, they are still alive. They've lasted much longer than any of the previous subjects. I knew that they would be perfect. Unfortunately, subject remains nearsighted. Continues to complain and struggle. And their vital signs are not ideal anymore. It's obvious that they're not going to last much longer. Luckily, my masterpiece is almost complete. I just need them to last one more day. Good. Good, it looks like that Saturday is starting to wear off. Why don't you give that another little snow, darling? Just to make sure none of the residual effects from the preliminary testing today are going to cause any trouble in the next phase. You see, darling, today is a very, very special day indeed. It's the culmination of everything that you and I have been working towards. <laughs> Don't be so modest, darling. This is very much your doing, just as much as mine. I couldn't have perfected my masterpiece without your help. You know, when my funding was cut and my permission terminated, I really thought that that was going to be the end of my dream position. But Thanks to you, my dear. My culmination of all of my work is finally about to pay off. It's going to be perfect. And it's all thanks to you. <laughs> but... I suppose before I show you my magnum opus, you should make sure that you are looking your best and feeling your best. Everything must be perfect after all. And you do seem to be quite a mess, don't you? No matter. Let me see your wrists, darling. How are they feeling? Yes, quite a lot of rawness there. You know, if you didn't strain against the straps, that wouldn't happen. You're really making this worse for yourself, you know. Oh well, no matter, no matter. Simply bandage them up quickly. Make sure that you are feeling your best. There we are. Just going to push those straps up a bit. No, no, certainly not taking them off. We learned to lesson, didn't we? 
Just push them up so that I can bandage that part of you. Yes, it is quite chafed. I wouldn't have to have them so tight if you just cooperated a little bit. You and I are doing something absolutely amazing. And if you continue to struggle, not to see the bigger picture. No one can ever see the bigger picture the way that I see the bigger picture. Oh, nothing a little binding and bandages and sedatives. Can't sell other recipes, my dear. Just Scoot the last one into the top there. And there we come. Was that too tight, darling? Mm. Mm. There. There. Hopefully that feels a little bit better, darling. Good, 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 good. Well. I do just want to give you a little bit of a checkup. Not that we haven't done this plenty of times before, but I just want to make sure that you are feeling the very best so that you can fully appreciate the brilliance of my masterpiece. Let's just take a little look, shall we? Where did that light go? Hmm. There we are. Ah. Alright, now darling, I'm just going to take a look into your eyes quickly. Just look straight ahead for me, please. Hmm. Alright, go over it this way. Yes, definitely, definitely slower reaction time. Look up for me, would you please? Look up for me, darling. Right, and look down, look down, look down. Right, and look over to this side, please. Look over to this side. Good, 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 good. Now look over to the side. Mm. Right, other eye, other one. Look up for me, please. Mm. Look down. Look over here. And look over here. Mm. Not ideal, I suppose, but I think it will work. How are you feeling today, darling? I suppose that's to be expected, but I think that it will suffice. I'm going to come over to this side, darling, and just take a quick look into your ears. Any issues around that ear? So I'll go over here. Mm. Oh, that should be all right too. Okay, okay. Now I've noticed that your reactions have become a little bit sluggish lately. I wouldn't want to untie you and have another. Unfortunate and time consuming failed escape attempt. But I can at least test your feeling, your face a bit. Right? Got this little wooden dowel here. One end has a little bit of a point to it. And on this end is quite flat. Right? So I want you to just close your eyes. You tell me if I'm poking you with the sharp side. On the flat side, all right. Close those eyes. Close the eyes. Thank you for cooperating, darling. Okay. Right. 
You got some of them right at the powers. Darling, you are looking a bit of a mess. You've really let yourself go these last several days, haven't you? Well, we can't have that. Everything must be perfect. And your appearance is anything but perfect. And let me just clean you off a little bit. Eh? Just a little bit. Oh, you'll be fine. Don't worry, this doesn't have any of my perfect little substances on it. This is just a cloth with water. I just don't want it to be so very dirty. It's not very respectful. All this work that I've put in, and I'm going to show you my masterpiece and come looking like this. Nothing mm. like a little cleaning camp, so... Mm. Well, mm, it's definitely looking better. Well, now I can see the bruises better. Mm. Hold on, I think I have it over here. Ah. There we go. <laughs> I'm not generally a very vain person, but doesn't mean that I don't know how to look nice when I want to. Just going to take a little bit of this concealer. You wouldn't want those bruises making today less than perfect, would you? Bruises wouldn't have happened if you had just cooperated. Oh well, no matter. It's definitely looking much better now, isn't it? Unfortunately, I would say perfect, but better at least. Okay. Oh, your hair is an absolute disaster as well. Um, I suppose that that will do for now. Or at least looking a little more presentable. My masterpiece deserves nothing less than perfection. The amount of work that has gone into this, I really don't think that you can understand fully. You see, you and I have had quite a few wonderful, very productive days together. But even before that, I've been working on this for so very long. And you were the final step. And you of perfection. Hmm. Well, I think we've finally cleaned you up. I think those preliminary substances have finally left your sister down. What were you? 
Yes. Why are vitals dropping so rapidly? Hold on. Here, I'll do a little bit more of this. Don't you? There. How does that feel? Okay. Hmm. Right. I think your vitals are evening out for now. Don't have too many more of these adrenaline syringes, but luckily, I don't really need them anymore. It's almost time. But I wouldn't want you crashing in the middle of my wonderful demonstration. Perhaps you should get some rest first, darling. And when you awaken, everything will be perfect. Wakey, wakey. It's time to begin, darling. Aren't you excited? <laughs> time for you to finally see the masterpiece that you have helped to create. I really couldn't have done it without you, darling. You've been just And now, it's finally finished. A culmination of all of our tests. All of the trials. All of my years of struggle. Everyone who didn't believe that this would happen. Everyone who thought that it was too much or going too far. Everyone who doubted the vision. Now they'll see. Now they'll finally see. The absolute brilliance that I hold in my hands here. Mm. Would you like to see it? Would you like to feel its effects? <laughs> Darling, we've come all this way. What would be the point if you didn't get to experience the full effect? <laughs> Maybe we'll start with just a tear. Just the tiniest bit of exposure. We'll see how we do from there, shall we? <laughs> that should be enough. Mm -hmm. 
Are you feeling dizzy? Disoriented? Is your vision going in and out? In and out? Means so very much to me. You have no idea. <laughs> amazing. Truly amazing what we can do when we work together. That was really just a taste of its power. I'm sure that you're dying to feel the full effect. <laughs> Don't be silly. What is life? without a little risk. No one ever accomplished anything without being willing to take some risks, break some rules. And if you have to discard that pesky morality in the process, I think you'll agree. It's worth Agree to disagree, then, I guess. Well, I was hoping that you would share in my excitement. But I knew the odds of that were not very high, given how much you have struggled and fought me. Remain so narrow minded through it all. Oh well. You've still been an amazing help. And my masterpiece is finally ready for the masses. And it's ready for you. The anticipation. It's too much, isn't it? Shall we count down? <laughs> Ten. Nine. Six, five, four, three.